Hi, I'm Kurt Klapier with TeachMomHow.com. This first episode, we're going to teach you the basics. We're going to teach you how to set up a Google Gmail account. That is because this will be the basis for your blog and for nearly everything else you will do in sharing your media on the web. First thing you're going to do is go to gmail.com. Once you're there, you'll see a screen like this. We're going to click on sign up for an account. Right here, sign up for Gmail. Now from here, it will ask for different pieces of information about us, our name, what we want our email address to be. So we'll start with our first name, fill in your last name, then put in your desired login name, or in other words, your email account. I'm going to put Jane Doe at gmail.com. Jane Doe 2007. Then you need to choose a password. This password needs to be eight characters in length. It can be numbers or letters. You need to re-enter your password just to confirm that you know it. And then we're going to scroll down and it's going to ask for a security question. You can choose what you want. I chose my first phone number. I put in the answer. This is something that we'll use if we ever forget our password. If you have a secondary email, enter that now. Be sure to put in your where you live. And this, we're just going to type in what we see there. This is just a security feature to make sure a computer is not making up email addresses. And then read the terms of and conditions and accept. Now it'll take us to the congratulations page and we can now go to Gmail from any computer and over here in the right hand corner we'll see a account login box go ahead and put in your username which is your Gmail email address and your password that you just set up click sign in this will take us to our inbox. From here we can send and receive emails just like in any other email service. Now the nice thing about Gmail is with your username and password you can now utilize all the other Google applications which we will teach you about in future episodes. Some of these applications include Google Reader. You'll also be able to set up and use your own blog and you will be able to use Google Docs. That's it for this episode. Please email us with any questions you may have, teachmomhow at gmail.com, and watch for future episodes where we will be teaching you how to blog and upload pictures and do it all.